We do have some Oh, there is there's the veil. They're gonna be jumping into the veil, going into the stealth right now. And here comes the engagement from Reticle moving in. Let's see. We have the bombs, we have bomb going down. No, as we can see again, big AoEs coming down here at the moment. Can't see any down targets just as of yet. Kill big old fight going down, bombs being thrown down, everybody using their cooldowns as well. We have I'm trying to see what else is going on here. As we have the big mid fight starting as well. We are gonna be seeing the uh, we're gonna be seeing the quickness field coming down there from the Mesmers. Hmm. As we see the quickness fields coming down, lots of wells getting thrown down here as well. Again, might channeling's coming out there. More from Pyro at the moment, as we can see them moving back in. Reticle's going to be trying to come in here, trying to get some more burst off of. No one down yet, though, as I can see. It looks pretty even for the time being. I could be wrong on that, though. Reticle numbers, the reticle blob is starting to look... Reticle blob is looking a little bit bigger than Pyro's blob, but this could be going on for quite some time. Another bomb being thrown here, but it appears to be reticle, as they do continue to go in here with the DPS gene. But it is looking like, at the moment here, we do have reticle on top of this one. DD Ellie's doing a nice job there as well as emo giggles is pointing out for me right now for all taking some heavy hits though as you just saw there getting hit in the middle but tight still going on as well more might stacks coming on there looks like they're regrouping here for the time being as well uh rep may be doing the same thing here too and again guys big reiteration on the fact that this is my first time ever attempting such a thing and as we see them going in again, Pyro just regrouped there again, but they, oh, we had a nice pull coming in there from, from uh, Pyro pulling the members of Reticle in. Not too much damage going off, though. And as we see, again, still going on. And I think for the next one, by the way, we are going to be moving down a little bit here so we can see the down bodies a little bit better. But again, uh, Pyro is regrouping at the moment here as they prepare to push in once more. Reticle doing the same thing right around here as you can currently see, but Pyro's grouped up nice and heavy. At the moment. They get split up a little bit there as they try to move in, but again, it is slowly looking like Reticle may end up coming out on top here for the first round. Pyro is a little bit split up. They're trying their best to regroup here uh, as they do get themselves back together. Also, channeling might, again, as you can see, 25 stacks there. Peralta does have. Uh, many of the other members are going to be having the same thing. Banner coming down there as well. I believe that did come in uh, on Pyro's side to get rest some members back up as this GVG does continue to go on. But again, Rhett looks like they're doing an excellent job. Pyro trying their best to regroup, but I do think this one is... Lots of wells getting thrown on here as well. I believe that is in favor of Pyro there. But again, as well, neither might... Uh, no, it's more might sex they're going to be trying to throw out right here. And Pyro, it looks like... No, maybe Pyro can come back into this now. I do think that Pyro is going to be taking this one. All right, here we go. Round two about to get started. Pyro again versus going up against Reticle. Pyro moving around right now. We also are seeing what appears to be, I think that's, yeah, channeling up Might over here. As we're seeing Reticle do that, just channel that up. And they're gonna now gonna be working their way in, waiting for the Veils pop up. Keep in mind, again, we are gonna lose the target on Reticle's commander as soon as they do jump into Veil. We did just have Pyro Veil up right here. They're gonna be pushing in right now. Here we come. Peralta making the lead right now. We actually still have targets. So as we're gonna see, the two blobs are colliding. Lots of AoEs being thrown in here at the moment. As well, we have the static fields going down. We have one down target, two down people here on Reticle's side. Two down down targets for Red, piling in on them, trying to get the rest off right now. Red's down target did just get up as well. We had a banner get thrown down. Another down target for Reticle right here. Is they're going to be trying to take him down in just a second. Uh, again, though, we do have them prop probably going to be trying to regroup in just a second here as they are grouping themselves up again. Try to come around the flank. Pyro, meantime, for hard focusing one person down here. We do have another down member on Reticle side. He's probably going to be getting knocked out. Just pure numbers that are sitting there. We did have someone else on Pyro side down there a second ago too, but I believe he was brought back up due to the banner. As this fight is going to be continuing on, they are falling back again. More AOEs being dropped down here at the moment. You can uh, the two blobs are colliding. Now. Nessie from Pyro is here in the down state as well. Another member is down. That could be a race. Oh, and with that, we actually did just did just see a member of Pyro going down, and as such, that allowed the member from Reticle to get back up and into the game. Another down target is right over here. I think that's okay. We do just have someone down there as well. But again, the two blobs are colliding once more. More AOEs being thrown down. The two the two blobs are just just going at it at each other right now, trying to see if we have any down targets or anything. Doesn't look like it at the moment here, as the fight does continue on. Again, we did have regroups just occur though, as they are trying to. It looks as though that we are seeing Reticle on the offensive here at the moment as Pyro falls back. Another down target in favor of Pyro. They are going to get that stomp off and that again will allow Pyro to get another man out and out of the game. I think we do have someone else that is down here. Red is Red is looking like they may be losing this round though because as we can currently see, Red is slowly getting eliminated but it is not over just yet. We still have uh, we still have Stalker leading, leading uh, for Reticle here at the moment here. As again though, Pyro just going in. Nice focus is indeed taking them down. Another member of Red. Another member of Red is down here as well. I think this is just a kill member of Pyro. Red has two downs here at the moment. One was just stomped out the second one here. They're trying to res him up as best they can at the moment, but he is in the downstate. Pyro coming all over him, dropping the bomb onto him. Probably going to be taking him out, and there we go. He's going to get knocked out. Pyro looks like they are just going to be cleaning up at the moment, and as Rhett has retreated, I think we can call that second round in favor of Pyro as well. We can pump it around. All 
Alright, and over here on the red side, I believe they're going to be doing the same thing right about now. Pump up the swiftness, and I think we're going to see them engaging in about a few seconds. Now, some teams will actually stack the, the symbols coming down from the Guardian. Some will pump a Warhorn or something to go with it, or even use the Ellie Statics. It's all really down to their actual play style. Okay. But they're empowering, and they'll probably veil up. Looks like it. Just Pyro's on. now empowering. Yep. Rhett already did. So Pyro put a veil down. And we are going to be seeing right retreating due to that. In. Yep, yep, falling back, but it looks like they have engaged. We do have the... Got we a do good forward static off. Nice, good forward static coming down there, but they are engaging on themselves right now. We see that coming down. They're pushing way far out this mm -hmm. time. They're way on the other side. We do see Pyro pushing pretty deep in at the moment. There can't really see any downs, though, at the moment. It looks like the Pyro is going to be falling back to regroup right now, though, as they get some more... I believe we had some more powers going off there, too, so they're probably going to be pushing in once more in just a few seconds. We do see uh, we do see Reticle's uh, driver. They're getting pretty low. He did heal himself back up, though, so for the time being, they're going to be okay. But again, uh, as they are pretty far out, it's hard to see if we have any downs or anything yet. We do see more static fields getting thrown yep. down, too. But as it can, as from what I can see, at least we don't see any downings right, just yet. Red has yet. a lot of downs at the moment. A Red lot has of them a lot of downs. Really, really low. All right, Red is having a lot of down players here at the moment as we, as we do continue this on. So Pyro doing an excellent job once more here in the third round as Reticle looks. Red like, has a down. All right, Red has a down here. Looks like they're trying to regroup at the moment here. Red is as they try to fall like back. Pyro but, has a bound down in the middle. One yep. of their Ellie's looks like one of Pyro's Ellie's is down. They got stomped. Looks like Rhett has another team about to get stomped at the moment. Right now they're trying to regroup. Yeah. See how they pull back. Pyro as well getting some more empowers off there. We did have a, we did have another static field coming down there. I believe that was Rhett, Rhett, uh, Rhett's, but as we saw too, they should have hit quite a few of them. So well, maybe they'll be able to get some more damage off because of that. Reddick's doing really good with their actual positioning and keeping yeah. things in the middle and all together and tight. They're doing really, really good at that. They are starting to break Pyro up. Back line, they have a lot of them that comes out and around. Yeah, I can see that right now. They they definitely they definitely are they definitely are doing an excellent job of keeping themselves out there and not not really getting hit up too much. But Pyro looks like I believe they right. Pyro That's won them. Who? Yep. All right, cool. Um, uh, I believe that was Pyro's just going off of the downs and stuff. Yeah. But I will verify just to make sure. Started now as we do see Pyro moving around. Things should be getting started here fairly shortly. Pyro moving through at the moment here. We could see a Veil any second now. Again, we are seeing Rhett buff themselves up with Swiftness. We had another Mark go down right over there, but at the moment they are just cutting around each other, waiting for the proper engagement as well. Another Swiftness Mark just went down there for Pyro. They're moving in right now. Probably. Right, Pyro. Oh, here comes the Empower. Empowering. There we go. Veil with as veil. well. Veil as well. Pyro going into Veil at the moment. Rhett will not be Veiling. Didn't oh, get a chance Rhett to, but didn't here we go. Look ready on that one. Nice engagement Pyro there by Pyro. Just jumped right in on him. Nicely done there, Lots although of wells down. they managed to cut off four or five people there. Nicely done by Pyro, I believe. Not right. sure if we got... They got somebody... Red I has someone way out of position, mm -hmm. way out in the Pyro back line. We do see someone down there, I believe he's going to be taking... We also had, we also had the uh, Mesmer Swiftest field going down there. Time Warp just got thrown down. Not sure whose that was. I believe it might have been Rhett's, actually. So, coming in again, we are going to be... We are going to seeing Pyro getting split up here a little bit. Might be forced to fall back and regroup, though. But again, because as we, as we again are seeing, Rhett does have themselves grouped up. This, um, grouped up pretty well here, despite the fact that they got broken up a little bit early there in the beginning due to Pyro's really nice right. engagement. Pyro's got it down. Oh, they were able to banner them and get him back up. Nicely Red done. did a really good job at coming back in all at once yeah. in order to try to save that guy, but they kept the ball together. And as we're seeing, so that makes them a lot stronger. All right, as they looks are. Like there's a ring up. Looks like someone's got a tornado up on the Rhett side. Down for Rhett right here, as we can currently see, might be going down. We'll have to see. I think they oh, banner just got thrown down. Double oh, banners actually, nice. bringing him back up and into the game. Nicely done there by the members of Rhett, keeping it alive. We have another low Rhett member here on the outskirts. Two low Rhett members here too. So things could uh, things could get pretty good for Pyro here in just a second. As again, we do have Rhett grouped up pretty nicely. Pyro again falling back though. We had another. Uh, we had some more. We have another bomb going down here. Two down members for Rhett here at the moment. Three nice. down members. Four down people for Rhett. One was stopped. So that's three more in the down state. I believe another one just got stomped out there too, so we still have two down members for Rhett. It looks as though, uh, though the Pyro is going to has a lot of low members. Yep, if Pyro you notice, as well the, the Rhett again. teams, they like to spread out a bit, so their back line, whether it's a DDLE or even their Necros, are out a little bit further in their parameter. Mm -hmm. As to where Pyro is trying to keep it more clumped up, that's it's, it can be okay, but it's actually really dangerous for that person that's out, because that's going to give them a, an easy stomp. Yeah. And as we are seeing, this is a definite win for Pyro. going in Pyro's favor yeah. for this round. Pyro just cleaning up right now, knocking out the last members of Ray, and it is going to bring it up to 4 0 now for Pyro. Coming 
We are just waiting for the engagement at the moment here. Rhett looks like they're going to be going in for it. Probably going to be seeing a Veil yep, maybe in a couple coming seconds. coming in first again. Pretty aggressive with it. Oh, someone else just moved in oh, there too. We had a thief jump in. Veil getting thrown nice. in. Nice. Yeah, nice little Pyro coming Hot in there. Pyro on surprise. Pyro mm -hmm. didn't even get their Veil off on time. Only about half. Jumped right on in there. Okay, only about like half the members got the veil. Although we Rhett's already got yep. it down. Rhett's got it down got here it down. right now as well. We had it. We had the aesthetic field coming down there in favor in favor of uh, in favor of Pyro. He's got another down. Nicely done, Pyro recovering from that early wow, engagement very there. Nice. Nicely done indeed. Although Rhett is sticking together as one group. Another down member from Rhett right here at the moment though. Not looks like he's going to be going down or up anytime soon. We had a banner, but I believe that was thrown out there. Up oh, there we oh, go. Second banner is going to get back up. up. He's back up and in the game as well. Another time warp was thrown out. I believe that was Pyro's time warp. Pyro uh, falling back and regrouping now with the empowers as they're going to be trying to get more Mike and they'll probably re-engaging in just a second. Rhett tried to do the same thing, taking advantage of Pyro's regroup as we're now seeing them move in though. Pyro getting a little bit split up. We do have the backliners here at the moment uh, as they, again they are going to be moving in. More static field getting thrown in though, trying to stun out some of the members. Although as we can see, no other downs at the moment they are just going up against each other uh another, another right, one of the really yeah spread out. another one of the backliners right is starting to get a little bit low here but also we're gonna have pyro grouping up for the empower once again here as they do try to go in they get it the off. engagement nicely done in power there nice uh nice nice empower there by there the members of pyro trying to do their empowers they're re-engaging nicely done and as we see them go in again no downs as of yet that i can oh, see and there's the down we, oh, oh, they got him up. Oh, nice. Done. Another banner used there to get them, to get him back up and into the game. Uh, as this fight is going to be continuing on. Oh, still, still fairly even, I would say. Although, again, we did see a couple of members of Rhett that did get knocked out there early in the fight. But we haven't seen many downs, in a, or we haven't seen many uh, outings in a while, though. We all do have... Oh, there goes another downing for Rhett there. I believe that was their Necromancer getting taken into the downstate. Peralta trying to go in for the stomp. Another downer there and for another Rhett. One. We have a th third one possibly going to be going down, too. So one was pretty low yep, health here. Yep, third down. Yep, third down as well. We could see a few more. Rhett's nice. starting to look a little weak here as well. We did have... I think we had one of their members pop oh, up Oh, and even too. another one. Yeah, nicely done here by Pyro. Looks like they're cleaning up nicely. And I think this nice one... Nice tornado. Made... It's just taking mm -hmm. their down. It's just keeping them out there. And I think this one may be going to Pyro, too. Although it doesn't look like Rhett's giving up just yet. Although Pyro is try. Pyro is just going straight forward at this point, going in, trying to knock out the remaining members. And it looks like their commander's just running back. He's just jumping back. That's it. Yep. Nicely GG. done by Pyro, taking a fifth. Pyro right now. takes five. Good job. They got some symbols down, but they're still yep. playing pretty close knits. Well like some people aren't even moving. I think they're trying to wake there everybody up still. <laughs> there we go, everybody's moving. Everybody got their Java shot. Mm-hmm. Rhett's ready to go, and here we go, guys. Round six, Pyromancers versus Reticle. Current score, five for Pyroman five for Pyromancers, zero for Reticle. Two more rounds to go, and let's see how things go. Pyro again going to be throwing down another Swiftness Field here. Reticle will be doing the same exact thing here in the back line. Two of those were actually thrown down. We had a Static Field thrown down two there. I believe Why that there's was a Healing Turret out there? I have no idea. I believe that was a bit of a troll. Could be wrong on that, but... Awesome. No one engaging just as of yet. Again, here we go. They're going to be empowering here in the back line. We're going to be a little bit farther away from the fight here, too. Power Pyro gonna, Veils. Yep. Pyro Veils. Little bit, a little bit far away, though, so they're not really going to get much use out of that. Did they catch someone out of position there? Is that a... Yeah. Wow, he's, yeah. Yeah, that's he's way out of position. Way out of position. Nicely done there by Pyro. Catching him out of position, although I think he got back in. We did have someone go down with us. We did see a, a banner get thrown down there. Yep. Holes. A lot of AoEs getting tossed down here at the moment. Another uh, another static field that you can see going in here right now. Uh, Rhett really grouped up here. You can see them highly condensed right, at the moment. Right, they're doing a lot better at that. As they're going to be pushing themselves into Pyro Zerk here in just a second as we get ready. Let's see what else is going on. Can't really see any downings. And might venture a little bit closer to try and see. No, they're doing really good this mm -hmm. time. They did pull themselves Great back movement. a little bit. Great movement. Great movement. They're staying close in together. You can definitely see as well. We had tornadoes coming out there from Red. The Ellie's are the Ellie's are popping tornadoes. Pyro was getting a little bit split up there, so we'll have to see as this fight continues on. Who can we have another downing from Red? We can see the downing here right now as well. Red right. did fall back to the group a little bit. That just stay way out of position, and Pyro is just jumping on yep. him. Yep. Red did lose oh, another member right there. See, yep, another Red downing as we never the like Red downing right there. Oh, they zero. got two downs. Nice. Three downs. Let me move a little bit closer. There, so they got that see. thief down that kept going out of position. Three downings for Red. Oh, the thief made it up and ran out. He's back in. Pyro's restacking and powering. Pyro going to be going directly into the Zerg again. We did have some lightning fields get thrown down there on Red side, trying to stun them out. As the fight does continue on, kind of split up. We have two of the red members again are really out of position. And Pyro is going to be trying to take huge advantage of that, knocking oh, them down. Them out yep. there. Another member, another member uh, that was out of position managed to get back in. However, I think the one in the back here did go into the downstate. Yep. I could be wrong. Yep. And he's going to be stopped out right now. 
Nuts shot, but we do have a member, a member of Pyro wasn't the downside, I believe it was an Ellie, so he vapor form back into his Zerg, so he should be getting back up in just a second as they try to rest him back up and into the game. Ret though grouping up, they did pop in powers a couple seconds ago, if not they had, but they had, uh, they had some, apologies, they had some, uh, they had some uh, fire fields down there, so they channeled some might through that as well there, but again, the two of the groups are going at each other at the moment, we can see, we can see a lot of AoEs on the floor here, as, oh, as this fight, this is, this is, Ret's doing really good in this one, I have to say, what, what do you take? Yeah, I, I think they're doing a lot better this time with their positioning and staying clumped together. Uh, Pyro is still able to get their regroups and stuff up. And there we go, Rhett's got another down. It's an Ellie, which could really hurt Red if they lose their water fields and stuff. Mm -hmm. but I'm not sure if they... Uh, yeah, that's GG. Rhett already pulled off into the stands. But if you left your Ellie down, there goes your water fields. Yep. But, yep, Pyro definitely took that one. Red symbols being thrown down. Pyro is going to be doing the same exact thing a few seconds ago, and they probably will throw more down on the way over there. But as we're seeing now, Pyro strafing their way up to the front lines, about to engage. Ragnarok out of position there and gets jumped on by one of the members of, Py of by one of the members of Red. Let's see, is he going to be able to survive this? He's extremely low at the moment, as you can currently see. He may get taken down, though. Again, he did have someone else come over there to assist him, so he may be able oh, to keep he himself beat it alive. Out. Nicely done there, indeed. Uh, can't see anyone. Nice, got it. Can't see anyone down yet. Nice static, though, that did get thrown right into the middle of Rhett's ready. See, Pyro, Pyro falling back. Huh? Yep, Pyro got the regroup in as well. They're going to be popping out that and power getting themselves back up. And it looks like they're going to be gauging right on the tail end of Rhett's ready, too. This could be nice as they go in, trying to get the damage off. Tomato up on the Rhett side. Nicely done. Pyro, again, grouped up pretty nicely here, but Rhett, really nice. When they do get hit pretty hard, they are looking like they're pretty good at actually getting themselves back together in the group and preparing for the next engagement. But Peralta going in, which means the Zerg is going to be falling directly and behind them. grouping yep. and empowering, and Pyro's trying to jump in and actually interrupt that. Not seeing any downs just yet, though, keeping everybody up and mobile for the time being. We did have another static field that get, got thrown down there on the side of Pyro, though. Not sure if that hit too many of the members of Rhett, and we're getting a little bit close. We had someone from Pyro going on, though. We got rezzed up there via the banner almost instantly. Uh oh it's getting a little too close to come for here we make it and we may end up getting pulled into this we have another member of Retina Downsy though again we did have the time work go down too he is oh nope they bannered him he's gonna get up back into the fight now as this fight will continue lots of banners nice getting thrown oh, in here. Still another got it member down. another member of Retina Downsy got a Necro down Necro stomp we have a lot of other members of Ret getting pretty low here as you can currently see one of the members of Fort, one of the members from Fort Aspenwood just went into the, or Ret, not from Fort Aspenwood from Ret just went into the down state we have another one down here right now as well a, a member from down. Pyro down whatever they're gonna be jumping directly on trying to get him back up uh, no field going down here right now too another banner from another banner from Ret I believe being able to bring their teammate back. Back up, Rhett fell back. Both of the groups are flying back. Everybody it looks like uh, it looks like Pyro's bombing onto this down body right here, trying to get him out of the game right now. And it looks like, let's see, I think they yep, they took it completely out. Another member of Rhett wiped out. We have Rhett's backliners here are a little bit vulnerable. Pyro is right in the middle of the line too. Pyro may be able to fall back and take these, or just turn around and take these guys out if they want to. But it looks like they're going to be going straight out into Rhett's big group. Uh, as we see though, Rhett looks like their health pools are starting to dwindle down a little bit, trying to check out Pyro here as we take a look. Rhett though looks like they're trying their best to regroup. Two members are down on the side of Rhett. Let's see if they're going to get down. One member was yep. down there oh, just a few seconds ago. It looks like the second one got up, though, I think. Could be wrong on that. But, again, another one just got thrown into the downstate. Pyro, uh, Pyro collapsing onto him, and they're going to take him down, too. And it looks like Rhett is starting to dwindle down here, but they're not out of it just yet. Pyro regrouping now. Probably going to get in power off in a couple seconds here, too. Let's see. It looks like they are falling back, waiting for this regroup. But Rhett has not given up yet. The remaining members are going directly in, trying to get the damage off as best as they can. But Pyro holding on strong. We did have another static field. I believe that was Red static field there. It's going to be stunning off some of the members of Pyro. And as the fight comes in, they're both just grouped up here at the moment. Can't see. A lot better on their movement, though. Mm -hmm. Okay, better. Red's got a couple downs. And they got a ban. Nope. And it looks like they nope, fell they didn't back. Ban it. They called it. Yep. They called it. So GG. 7 0 Pyro. You gotta give Rhett props though. They got a lot better with their positioning and their regroups and actually staying clumped together. Mm-hmm. So nicely done by Pyro with the 7-0.